Well, cookouts and trips to the beach are, of course, fun. But on this day, it is also important to remember those who gave us the freedoms we enjoy this and every day. Each year, a Memorial Day ceremony is held at the Laney Valley's Memorial Gardens. And right now, WJZ is live in Timonium. That's where Jessica Albert spent the morning attending today's ceremony. Jessica. Hey, Denise, that ceremony just wrapped up a few moments ago here. It specifically honors uh, service members who have passed away with ties to Maryland in the last year. And this year, we're sadly honoring three service members. Memorial Day is a time to honor the fallen. Many showed up to do just that at the 55th annual Memorial Day ceremony at Delaney Valley Memorial Gardens. Every year, the memorial honors military members who gave their lives in service to our country and highlights those with ties to Maryland that have passed away in the last year. This year, three fallen heroes were honored. The speakers at the ceremony underscored the fact that we cannot forget the ultimate sacrifice these heroes and their loved ones pay for our freedom. This isn't simply an extra day off on a long holiday weekend that begins the summer. This is a day to remember, to remember that others paid for every free breath you ever get to take. And we will be speaking to the people who attended this ceremony. We will have much more for you coming up tonight on WJZ News at 5 and at 7. Reporting live in Baltimore County, Jessica Albert for WJZ. Thank you, Jessica. Well, in Washington, D.C., Friends of the National World War II Memorial and the National Park Service pay tribute to the more than 400,000 Americans who lost their lives during World War II. The Memorial Day service was held at the National World War II Memorial. Several veterans of that war laid wreaths in memory of those lost.